dear students today we shall discuss shortest distance between two lines two lines are there you see l1 and l2 l1 and l2 are two lines then the shortest distance between them is the length of the line pq which is perpendicular to both the lines pq is a line segment which is perpendicular to both l1 and l2 then the length of this line pq is called the shortest distance between two lines so the shortest distance sd sd for shortest distance is the length of the line segment perpendicular to to both the lines We have L1 and L2, two lines. PQ line segment is perpendicular to both the lines L1 and L2. Hence, the length of the line PQ is the shortest distance between two lines. So, we have to find out the shortest distance or the length of the line PQ. Line L1 given. X minus X1 by A1 is equal to Y minus Y1 by B1 is equal to Z minus Z1 by C1. And line L2 given X minus X2 by A2 is equal to Y minus Y2 by B2 is equal to Z minus Z2 by C2. These are two lines, L1 and L2. So, first of all, we have to find out the coordinates of P and Q. So, P is any point on line L1. So, we can find out the coordinates of the point P by taking L1 is equal to R1. And we can also find out the coordinates of point Q by equating line L2 with R2. That means the coordinates of point P coordinates of P is given by you see here equating the first term to R1 we have X is equal to A1 R1 plus X1 and then equating the second term to R1, we have Y is equal to B1 R1 plus Y2. And equating the third term to R1, we have C1 R1 plus Z1. So, these are the coordinates of point P. Similarly, we can find out the coordinates of the point Q by equating the line L2 with R2. So the coordinates, coordinates of point Q is given by, again equating the first term, A2 R2 plus X2 and B2 R2 plus Y2 and C2 R2 plus Z2. So the coordinates of point P and Q, here we have written, now the DRS of the line PQ, if the coordinates of two points are given, we can find out the DRS of the line by X2 minus X1, Y2 minus Y1 and Z2 minus Z1. So the DRS of the line 
DRS of the line PQ is given by A2R2 plus X2 minus A1R1 minus X1 B2R2 plus Y2 minus B1R1 minus Y1 and C2R2 plus Z2 minus C1R1 minus Z1. So, you see the DRS of the line PQ we have calculated here. The DRS of the line PQ. This is the process we should follow to find out the length of the line. So, DRS of the line is now we have written here and in the next video we shall discuss how to find out PQ.